Jesus name. Before you go, finally, finally, we're going to shout seven hallelujah. But before we shout that seven hallelujah, is anybody here? Don't feel shy. You know you are not a child of God. If you are not a child of God, everything we have said here today, it will not benefit you. In fact, when you get outside that gate, the devil will rob you of all the blessings you have received. You are saying, Pastor, I don't want to miss out. I want to give my life to Jesus. If you are one of them, lift up your right hand. Let me pray for you. Don't feel shy. Lift it up. Good. Oh, great. Oh, great. Five people. Another person? Another person? Lift it up. Lift it up. This is the best thing that can happen in this conference. You want to give your life to Jesus? Glory be to God. Those of you lifting up your hand, please come forward. All of you, step forward. Step forward. This is the greatest thing that can happen here. Come, come. You can still join there. Don't feel shy. You know within yourself that if you die now, there is no hope of heaven. But you want your sins forgiven. Come. 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 God bless you. Say this after me. Say, Lord Jesus, I confess all my sins. Please forgive me. Jesus, come into my life. Be my Lord and my Savior. In Jesus' name I pray. I declare your sins forgiven. Power to sin no more, receive it. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Anybody to attend today? Anybody to attend today? Okay, go and meet our daddy there. God bless you. Finally, finally, look everybody. Please don't feel shy now. Are you here? Don't feel shy, I beg you. This one is to the glory of God. You came to this vigil last night. You have sickness in your body. You have pain. But as we pray, as we sing, you can't feel the pain again. I want to pray because affliction must not come again. Let me see your hand up. You receive instant healing. Lift up your, that hand. Please, can you come? I must pray for you before you go. Come. Check your body. Check your body. You came last night. You came last night. You had pain. Don't need that. Emma, need Emma, but don't let pray for you. Check your body. You came last night. Sickness in your body. But now, you can't feel it again. Come. 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 Okay, the rest of you, you can sit down. Let's hear their testimony. Let's hear what God did for them. Hallelujah. Mm. Brother, what did the Lord do for you in this meeting? Yesterday, I was weak. I even told my neighbor that I will not be able to come. And I told her, that's pretty just... It was after 11. As I finished eating, I just bathed. Once we just said, stand up, be going. I just get up and I went to take my bath and I start coming. Right now, like this, I can't feel any pain. I can't feel weak again. I'm strong in the Lord. Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. God bless. Sister, what did the Lord do for you? Like this pain, this pain that I usually feel here at my left hand side is like two weeks ago. Yes, I've been feeling the pains and I usually think, is this something wrong with the heart or something? I have that, yes, I have that fear in me. I always have that fear. In me. This one, I cannot feel it again. Wow. Yes, it again? exactly, I cannot Who feel it again. Jesus. Jesus. Come to this side, God bless you. About what did the Lord do for you, sir? One of my, one of my right hand leg. Right leg. Right, leg. right leg is burning me, but so I just prayer goes on now. The pain that I have removed from my body. The pain has disappeared. disappeared Can you man. say that way for Jesus? Baba, who healed you? Jesus. I'm going to pray for you, sir. What did the Lord do for you? The Lord healed me from sharp pain in my tummy. Sharp pain? For how long have you been having? Weeks now. Who healed you? Jesus. Are you happy today? Yes, I'm happy. What did the Lord do for you? The Lord healed me. I didn't even want to come at all. Because I was feeling pain in my leg. I said, I'm not going. But when I now saw the text for my daughter, I said, ah, I cannot say no. Let's go. I said, mm, reluctantly, we are coming. All along when we are, some people will say, mommy, stand up. But to the glory of God, I can say, Jesus. Sister, what did the Lord do for you? Before coming this evening, I was having a sharp pain on my throat. And I was thinking, I said, will you be able to sing? So when I came in, I was sweating. And they were able to ask that you came late. I was just looking at that. They don't know what I was passing through. So I was, even as I was sitting down there, they were not telling me that you would back up. I said, with this throat, but throughout the singing, everything, I could not even feel any pain again. Jesus.
Wow, this God is wonderful. My brother, what did the Lord do for you this morning? I came up here with an anticipation that I am healed. Jesus is there. It has been settled. Let's pray for all of you. I have been having waist pain for almost three weeks now. Yes, Satan was even trying to use it to discourage me from coming to the VG, but I said no. So as I came in, the service was going on. I feel relief. I can even jump. When we are singing, hey. praising God, I can jump. So you, can't I can you, bend. I can't bend. you can't bend before. Okay, bend now. Bend now. Bend now. Somebody shout Jesus. Jesus. What did the Lord do for you? God did for me. My back from this one to my waist. We've well, been three, three weeks now. So, so if I go uh, this morning as we are praying, as we are praying, I even they pray for my husband. Say, God, heal me. And God did it. I can bend. So you, you can't bend like this before. So you cannot bend now. Who healed you? Jesus. Glory be to God. What did the Lord do for you? God healed me in my left breast. When we are praying and dancing, sometimes we come, sometimes we go. So God healed me today. Wow. Pain in the, in the left breast, but this, the pain disappear. It will never come back again. What did the Lord do for you? Straight to the point. Praise the Lord. As I was telling uh, my fish, I don't want to come to church. I saw one this moment that ah, yele ja show ni wa ni. Mo ni o ti re mi mi ni wa. Bati mo wa dele. E mi e koni. Ma lo church jare, ma lo church jare. O ye lo we lo we buko sare we buko wosu. So ba she enjoy ye. Ba she enjoy ye mi mo. Mo she shube mi e kon. Be mi shubu sha mo she didi a yaton do ni. Ma wa wa. What do you do for you? He healed me through my like three weeks now, having some eye pain. I was just my eye will be eating me. I'll be scratching it to just so that it will be red and people will be asking me what happened, what happened. So this night, about to come, a sister, one of my neighbors came to me that Mommy, I am going. You know, I said, be going, I'm coming. I gave her a pad. When you go to church, it's spread a pad for my children because they've already slept. When I come back, I will lie there. But most people tell me, don't go, don't go. I was so struggling in myself. When I came in, they meet me again. My head was meeting me there. See the time you are coming. I said, sir, you won't understand. So I just came in. I said, will I be going back? I don't know. So when I came in, the eyes started me again. I said, Father, this tonight, this eye must end. So after the prayer, the thing started me again. I just ran to the toilet. I used water, I washed my eyes. I said, this is the end of it. I cannot feel anything again. Praise the Lord. Yes, sir. Jesus. As you said, I feel it, but I heard it. Since I did for this, you just started, I feel it, but I heard it. But now, the door more heard it. And I heard it. It's Jesus. Praise the Lord. I've been having this consistent day because for like three days I've not slept. So when that, yeah, when that man called, calls out that if you know you've now slept for three days, I came out. And while I was singing, I don't want to raise my voice because of the headache, but now I cannot feel it anymore. Yeah. Jesus. 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 Hallelujah. Glory be to God. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Jesus healed 14 people in one service. Only him can do that. Father, we return the glory to you. Affliction will not rise the second time. Let your healing be permanent. In Jesus' name we pray. For what God has done for you, 26 seconds more, 7, hallelujah. After the seventh one, with joy and excitement, you will go to seven people, you will tell them, I am the celebrant that you are looking for. Rise up, everybody. Are you ready? Are you sure you are ready? One, two, three. Let's show!